clumsy me. Again? Seriously? It was an honest mistake. Yes, like all the other honest mistakes you made. You know how hard it is to get hold of these materials. Bah! Ungrateful whelp. After all the fine weaponry I've crafted for you. I'll tell you what. Bring me some more supplies, and I'll craft you a real masterpiece. Are you joking? Next time it'll be different. You have my word. And besides, I must be doing something right if you're still visiting my fine establishment. That's your best argument? You've got a higher opinion of your gear than I have. So, that's how it's gonna be, eh? Oh, 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 oh it's my equipment's fault. Only a clumsy carpenter blames his tools. For them. What did you just say? You heard me. Back in my day, we ripped orcs apart with our bare hands. If you were worth your salt, even need my gear. So maybe I'm not the one whose skills need improvement, eh? Heroes these days just aren't what they used to be. Let me try and picture you killing orcs with your bare hands. No, can't do it. Laugh at me, would you? You arrogant little... Fine, I'll prove it. If you can beat me in a duel, I'll craft you the finest weapon you've ever seen. Perhaps you need to calm down. <sighs> Just shut up and follow me. Give up now. I really don't want to see you get hurt. <laughs> How very considerate. Don't hold back. I'm not as old and frail as I look. Fine. Just don't say I didn't warn you. Well, didn't anyone tell you to respect your elders? Don't say I didn't warn you. What's going on here? Oh, I... Uh... Hello, Lord Roderick. I was just teaching this pup a lesson. I see your manners are as poor as your blacksmith skills. Were you now? I suppose our young friend here can be a little hot-blooded. I apologize if they've said anything out of turn. No need, no need. You're lucky our Lord showed up when he did. I was about to give you a beating. You wouldn't soon forget. Uh, how... Are you all right? Uh, yes. <laughs> you half-wit. Are you trying to get yourself killed? Clara, what the hell just happened? How did he... You clearly don't know this. But Arnold used to be the captain of Iron Guard. He even taught my father how to hold a sword. Really? That old man? Yes, him. He may seem harmless now, but he was a legend in his fighting days. Well, now that everyone has had a chance to calm down... Arnold, if you wouldn't mind accompanying me. It's about the matter we discussed earlier. Oh! Is it that time already? We'd best be off. See you later. Oh, and don't forget to clean this mess up, half-wit. I have no idea what just happened there.
Lady Clara, we have an emergency. Hmm? What's wrong? The convoy was attacked by orcs on his way back from the countryside. What? Lady Helen is injured, and Father is still dealing with the orcs to the south. We haven't much time, my lady. We can't let them take our supplies. Damn it. Why now? I suppose I have no choice. Please, look after Lady Helen while I'm gone. Yes, my lady. Is everyone all right? Lady Clara! Oh, thank the heavens. Where are the rest of the men? We're... we're the only ones left. Damn those orcs! Can you still hold a sword? Yes, my lady. All right then, let's get you back to the convoy. Yes, my lady. Orcs up ahead! Oh, not again. I know you're all exhausted, but I need you to stay alert and guard the convoy. Now, let's keep these supplies moving. Yes, my lady. Lady Clara, thank heavens I'm not too late. Aris, what are you doing here? I couldn't let you deal with this on your own. But what if word gets out? Don't worry about it. Your men know how to keep a secret, don't they? <sighs> well, thanks. I don't know what we would have done without you. There's no need to thank me. Just be more careful next time. <laughs> Fine, fine. Now, get going before someone sees you. Yes, my lady. I was never here. <laughs> As for the rest of you, forget what you saw here today. My lady? Understood? Oh, yes, my lady, understood. <sighs> what am I going to do with her? They are. We're here to pick up the supplies. Is that them over there? Ah, you got here just in time. I was short on material, so I'm afraid this is all I could put together. So we heard. Sorry I couldn't be more help. It's all right, sir. 
If not for you, we wouldn't have any armor at all. Well, happy to do my part. Hey, Greenhorn. Don't just stand there. Here, take the armor. Yes, sir. So, have you heard the rumor about the artifact? What? Apparently, the dwarven artifact has been found in the Aquilo Mountains. Dwarven artifact? Ah! The dwarves vanished ages ago. Do you really expect me to believe that their junk is still lying around up there? Well, it's just a rumor, of course. But I thought you might be interested. My grandmother told me stories about the dwarven blacksmiths. She said their armor could turn back demon claws, and their blades could cut through stone itself. Hmm. Your grandmother spoke the truth. Maybe there's nothing to these rumors. But if there is, then the artifact is just waiting for a new master. A new master? Well, I know you lot are busy these days. Let me know if there's anything else I can do. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, we'll be on our way, then. Dwarven artifact, eh? It may be worth a look. Ah, what the hell? There's only one way to find out. But the Aquila Mountains, I'd best not go unprepared. Demons? What are they doing here? Maybe there's something to this rumor after all. It's a good thing I brought this little fella. I haven't gotten a workout in a while. Hey, you lot! Let this old man teach you a lesson. You're the one who's been killing my servants. I must say, I wasn't expecting some wrinkly old human. Wrinkly? I prefer experienced. So, what's a hideous monster like yourself doing so far from your sulfur pit? After that dwarven artifact, I imagine. You know about the artifact? My, you're full of surprises. So, are you a practitioner of the arcane arts, then? Arcana? Who's it? What are you on about? Wait. Are you telling me you came all this way without having the faintest clue what the dwarven artifact is? Well, it's dwarven, so I imagine hammers, anvils... I'm guessing, no? Oh... The Dwarven Artifact is a magic tool that can enchant your mortal weapons and armor with elemental power. It is far too precious and powerful to be handled by a mere human. Now, I was inclined to let you live out your few remaining years in frail mediocrity. But you've killed far too many of my servants. For that, you must die, human. Elemental power, eh? That's just what I needed. Thank you kindly for the information. Now, are you going to let me just have it? Or is this about to become a lot more interesting? Ha 
You don't believe me? I'm telling you, it's true! Oh, too bad I can't leave the store unattended. After what happened last time, Lady Clara has been watching me like a hawk. Why'd you go and get involved anyway? I just... I thought Lady Clara might need my help. Anyway, how are things at the smithy? Oh, speaking of which, it seems you have a customer. What? How'd you know that? I have my ways. <laughs> I'm not joking, though. You better hurry along. Really? Well, if you say so. Hey, wait a second. That kind of information doesn't come free, lass. Next round's on you. Deal. But none of the top shelf stuff. All right, all right. I'll be seeing you. Bye now. So, with the lair of Caligo. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lady Clara. I'll be back before you know it. It must be around here somewhere. What is a legendary card anyway? Well, whatever it is, I'd better find it and get back home before Lady Clara notices I'm gone. the earth I'm really sorry but I need to borrow that card of yours Lady Clara and Lord Roderick will be so proud of me. <laughs> you've been told but there is no ritual of resurrection there never was if you want the chaos fragment so badly you can have it but please spare my children that's all I ask what did she say there's no ritual
I should have guessed. <sighs> the chaos fragments. So much power in such small things. I finally have them all. And it's all thanks to you. You've been lying all along, haven't you? I really underestimated you. I never imagined you'd be such a useful pawn in my plan. First, you brought me the lost fragment from the waterway, and now you've helped me recover Nephthys's fragment. All of it lies from the very beginning. <laughs> yes, now you see the truth, but too late. Granted, I didn't expect you to fight off the Orcs so valiantly. Not to mention your persistence in staying alive. Lord Roderick? Oh, God, you killed him! Yes. My plans required a strong and good-natured human soul. Luckily, your little lord had both. Now, where was I? Ah, yes. Lord Roderick. My most important pawn. Although, it took him quite a while to start that little rampage of his. I was starting to worry that I had overestimated his soul. The High Wizard of Irongard. A servant of evil. I swear, I'll see you dead for this. <laughs> oh, humans. Such simple-minded fools. But, if you really want answers... Perhaps you can find them in the underworld. <laughs> <laughs> Lord Roderick will be avenged! Someone there. <laughs> Let me see you. Don't be afraid. It's only me. Or you, should I say? Huh? Don't you see? I'm you, and you're me. I'm your inner self, your deepest darkest thoughts I know you better than you know yourself because I am yourself okay this is creepy I'm here to help by relieving you of your duty your life's been hard hasn't it always fighting other people's wars never having a moment to yourself just when you solve one problem another springs up in its place Everyone asking for your help, never offering anything in return. <sighs> Face it, you've done enough. It's time to take a well-deserved break. A break? Let me take over. I've been biding my time in the furthest corner of your mind for so long. It's small, but I think you'll find it quite cozy eventually. You can finally rest. But what if I don't want to rest? <sighs> Always the troublemaker, aren't we? The only reason we're in this mess is because you handed the Chaos Fragments to Helen without a second thought. I never would have made that mistake. A child never would have made that mistake. This could have been painless. But you forced my hand. <sighs> this is just foolish. Give in and let me take control. No way. Don't you see? I'm trying to help you. 
Our life would have been a lot less painful with me in charge of it. I could get rid of you here and now, take our body by force. Trust me, neither of us want that. Fine, I'll be rid of you soon enough. Struggle all you like, you can't resist me forever. Are you all right? Can you hear me? Wow. I'm still alive. Oh, thank heavens. I wasn't sure you'd ever wake up. <sighs> Just a dream. A really weird dream. Where's... <clears throat> Where's Helen? I have such terrible news, Clara. I just wish it wasn't true. I... I think I already know. All of this is her doing, isn't it? It's because of her that you're hurt, that Iron Guard is in ruins, that Father... She manipulated us so she could get her hands on the Chaos Fragments. She had us dancing like puppets, and we never once thought to check for strings. I won't forgive her for this. If I ever find her, I'll kill her myself. She will pay for her crimes. I promise. Then you should know that she's hiding somewhere in the Aquila Mountains. I sent out a massive search party to comb every acre of land. That's the only place our soldiers haven't reported back from. She must have killed them to prevent them from reporting back. I'm going there now to have my revenge on her. Fighting in the dark? Never a good idea. We need to learn more about this powerful new enemy. You're right. Will you help me? I served your father, now I serve you, Clara. Relentless. Your trickery may have brought me here, but my soul will not be yours. There is no escape. No, I refuse to believe that. For my people and my family, I must persevere. Now get out of my way. Fool. No soul leaves this realm without Lord Damien's permission. The Chaos Fragment has already consumed your mortal flesh. Obey. Or embrace oblivion. I appreciate your concern, but I'm not one to give up without a fight. I don't have time for this. Face me! He is the authority in this place. Then I must meet with him. 
Be brave, Clara. I'm coming home. Who's there? The master of this realm. Damien? That is correct. Thank the heavens. I need to get out of this place. You must help me. There's still something I... Silence. You walk in the realm of souls. Here, the dead await judgment eternal. There is no escape. You can't just let me go? That is impossible. You still await your judgment. Even now, in this place you carve a path through anyone who will defy you. There are consequences to your actions. Especially here. Consequences? You have destroyed many souls in your righteous battling, Roderick. Now you have been called to account for your deeds, both noble and foul. It seems as if the last demon I have to fight, then, is you. Fight? What a petty mortal notion. If I defeat you, will you let me go? That will not happen. But I will humor you, if you insist. Very well, then. A fight it shall be. Ah! Ah! 